everybody. Uh, it's Adam is someone, and I'm back. I think it's part three, four. Are we part four already. <laughs> part four of Sucker for Love. Um, I don't remember what happened last time. I think I got married. Uh, I think I got married. I think I think it was marriage. I'm not even gonna lie. I think I got married. Oh hey, I got married. Okay. Uh. Gulp. Okay, let's just start from here. Mask your Eldritch Mouth Hole. Yeah, Eldritch Mouth! The best character. It still has a nerving. Well, get in the shower! Okay. Uh, let's see. <laughs> this ritual. Performing this ritual after Esther's masquerade will have consequences. But. Okay, so we do masquerade and then we do the thing. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. Put on the mask. Uh I need some elegant robes. And I have a knife. Hey, hey gotta go look in the mirror real quick. Hmm, look in the mirror. Hmm, looks like everything's set. I feel gizzied up. Even for me it's pretty loud, but you know, you know, it's I'm a pretty you know. You clean up well. I'm impressed. You'd be presentable before my royal court in that. That's awesome. Let's keep the skip. We already did this. Let's do the play. Interior well lit. Need a well lit interior. Take off the squid mask. Let's do this thing. Welcome, company, much cherished. My, may my loneliness thus perish. To this evening we shall share, which would be wasted by myself. No attendants have arrived tonight, alas, besides thyself. But I'll be beside myself when the king reveals himself. Yeah! Yeah! Give thine hands upon my <laughs> bodice, for before you stands a goddess. Know this guest of goldenrod is merely the first of the night. Let us drink to your great wealth and family and life, lasting till your afterlife. I'll be yours once he arrives. Alright, let's keep going. Slowly. Surely. Yes, until my schemes may flourish, we shall haunt my empty fortress. Let us dance, a whirling dervish, while we feed our appetites. By the morrow, we shall know if the king came tonight. Midnight marks the final chime. Until that comes, there is still time. Be graciously obeisant. Demonstrate a courtly patience. He declines no invitation he receives upon his court. All who have doomed you till will know without report. The king arrived by your escort. A prophecy of grim import. We did it! All right. Now let's mess everything up. Let's destroy everything. You'd be like, wow, you did so good at him, someone. An immaculate performance, dearest. Bravissimo. Thank you. Skip! <laughs> we don't care about the dialogue. We're sp oh, I'm kidding. Okay. Let's do that. If you hear a she's on, proceed in total darkness. Sure, no imagery. Total darkness. Turn off. Turn off. Where my, where my uh, ceremonial robe and ritual necklace? I think I have the robe on. Hey, don't mind me. Get it. Get out. Okay. Let's... Robe, knife. Second step on the previous page. Uh. <laughs> Do we take down the poster? I hope we took down the poster. All right. Time to make everything awful. It's on my face! I'm- <laughs> Uh-oh, I can't get the ritual mask to stay over my masquerade one. Morning. Is everything alright? Oh, and you're out of the shower, finally! How'd you finish? Last time you didn't even finish. Uh, yeah, I'm just working on my pronunciation. She's right in front of me. Maybe I have my furry my face in this book. Bury my face into the book. She won't see it. Surely. Oh, are you stuck on a word? I can help you sound it out. Let no, me see the page. No, you don't have to look. No, no, I got it. I'm a big boy. I can't even pronounce this word. It can't be hard to figure out more than English. Uh. It would probably be easier to read if the book wasn't upside down, darling. Oh, that explains why I couldn't read it. Haha, <laughs> okay, I think I got darling. it now. 
Why are you holding it so close to your face? The font shouldn't be that small. It's very small! Uh, my eyesight has been going for a while now. I gotta pick up some prescription reading glasses. But I keep putting it off. <laughs> I didn't know you need glasses. I uh, usually wear contacts. But you aren't wearing them now? Oh, I guess not. I must have dropped them on the ground somewhere in the last reality. Darling! Yeah? Put the book down. Gold? Now. That's it. I'm scared. If you see this masquerade mask on my face, you'll know I've been meeting with the Esther. Think, think, think! Oh, ow! Quick, bathroom! Open this door. No! Will that door hold? No doubt you have this mask still on my face when she gets in. So I have no other option. I dig my fingers under the edge of the mask. I gotta rip it off! <laughs> Feels like I'm pulling my very fingernails off mere meal meters of leverage. The mask just fused in my skin. I'm taking off large chunks of flesh with every pull. This pain, it's unreal. I'm naked! It's do or die. I take a deep breath until my skin is taut and there's no more to give. Then I. Why did you lock me out, darling? Heavens below! What happened to you? Are my eyeballs gone? I, I, I can't even formulate thoughts right now. Whatever happens, happens. Is, is that why you were hiding your face? No, baby. I don't care about any of that. I'm not so shallow that I'd fuss over what you look like. My eyeballs are gone. I'm here because I like you. No matter what happens to you. So don't be so <laughs> self-conscious around me, okay? Where did my... <laughs> where are my eyeballs in my nose? Where's the mask? Lynetta. Shh. Just let me hold you. Sweet, the ceiling right now almost makes tearing off my face worth it. Almost. Just stay right there until you're mentally prepared to continue. I don't think I can. I think I'm dying. Okay. I end up blacking out from the vein, waking up sometime later in my bed. The golden mask is nowhere to be found. Did you find my golden mask? I can't even talk to her. What if we did banquet? <laughs> Do we have to go outside? Wait, what if we did this actually? Receive ingredients. Right, red fire candles. Allow King into the room. Okay. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Ouch, my face hole. Okay. Right, red fire candles. Huh? Darling, who? Oh, you know, I thought it was going to be kind of funny. Hey! Uh, I just want to get some light in here. Dearest. I just wanted light in the room, honestly. <gasps> My sister? You did it. Oh, dear. I don't know what I did. Look at me, darling. What's going on? I just want to get light in the room. Obviously, your darling has been playing us for fools. That's untrue. <laughs> I thought I had you wrapped around my finger to think you broke your vow of fealty for this slovenly understudy. Esther, I knew you were a bedazzled diamond dozen hussy that feds the first literate ass kisser that'll sit through your little skits, but I expected better from you, darling. I'm sorry. Did you really think you were just going to date two outer gods at the same time and get away with it? Yes. Hold on, did you just call the king in yellow a skit? It is a composition of theatrical genius that a Philistine like you couldn't appreciate if you had another thousand years sleep to mull it over. But if my play is too cultured for your tragically unrefined sensibilities, perhaps you've heard the one about the watery tart who never gets a second What's date. happening? I'm sorry, okay? I just wanted to put light in the room. True comedy. Smile. You uppity little... Hey, go how do you do? There's enough of me to go around. Can we all just switch and make up? <laughs> that, that's not happening. <laughs> that is not happening. Okay, so that's not. Hmm. Okay. I'll just smell. Mama. So we start from Masquerade, I think. Did we already do a Masquerade? Invitation. 
Masquerade. I have the mask on. I have my robes on. Ritual knife. Look in a mirror. I'm sure it's done. Okay. Cool. Everything's good. Oh, my eye holes. <laughs> oh, my eye holes. My eye holes. Okay, let's do this. Um. <clears throat> Did I read too fast? Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Did I read too fast? What I know? Stupid play. Anyway. Stupid play. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> what do I do? It's stupid. What am I doing wrong? Am I dumb? Well, I know that, but I've done this like three times. How do I forget? It needs to be well lit, god damn it. <laughs> Just turn the lights on! God damn! I thought they were already on! Alright, let's do this thing. Yippee, we did it! Go, 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 go! They're clapping. We did it. And, it's like, wow, you did great. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. Now we're going to just ruin everything. Now. Let there be no darkness. All right, you need to leave. <laughs> you need to get out. If you hear someone, something strange, it's not your imagination. Be ready. Proceed. Total darkness. No imagery. Wear a robe and necklace. Wear a mask. Have a ceremonial knife. Mask, mask. I have robes. Turn off all imagery. Have a knife. I have- What? I put it on. You're cheating. Uh oh! I gotta rip my face off! <laughs> okay, let's mess this all up. Let's do banquet now. Or at least try to. Okay. Retrieve ingredients, right red fire candles. I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna read it. <laughs> Gosh darn. I did it. Okay. There are no robes. Have the offering and well, 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 light the room. I'd say that's pretty well lit. <laughs> this is the last time. What happened? Why she got mad? Oh. Oh, now we do this. Ingredients. She's asleep. Come in. These are red. Okay. I'd use up my supplies to cook for the Netta. All that's left are leftovers for a dark ingredient. You must be kidding. You were seriously planning on serving this to me? Looks good, right? <laughs> Wait, I can explain! Yes, do. I have nothing. Mere leftovers for a king? How humiliating! If you would serve your king leftovers, who, pray tell, did you find worthy of the feast? She's onto me. She's gonna figure out I serve her to the Netta. I hear heavy change dragging nearby. I just got hungry. I skipped breakfast this morning, so. You ate an entire feast on your own because you were feeling peckish? Yes. So, the person you think deserves to eat before the king does. Is you? Yes! Such self-idolatry is a serious crime against me. God, king, and heiress to Carcosa. Conveniently, the punishment for blasphemy and treason is the same. Death. <sighs> what a shame. I thought you had some potential, but you're a totally worthless servant in the end. Nah. -uh. 
Oh god, she's serious. I'm seriously gonna die here. Wait, wait. What if I did something to appease you? Then would my crime be forgiven? I am God King. All is as I say. If I wish for you to be pardoned, then it shall be so. What do I do? <laughs> Perhaps if you grovel on your hands and knees, I can let you off lightly. I immediately drop into a full prostration bow. Please forgive me. Let me make things up to you. I beg you. <laughs> you look so pathetic like that. <laughs> Don't you see your like sister in my bed? Well. <laughs> Just taking a nap. I'm a lowly worm, forgive me, but don't let me off with a harsh punishment first. You... Don't you think you said that too willingly? I'm not a masochist! Checking, but you're not... Enjoying... No! Right? No! I'm not my... I'm not my... No! No! Oh, you shameless... Pig. I'm not! It's him, not me! This is what you were about to try to feed me, right? And this will be your trough! It's not me! It's him! Oh, you want to bite? Even though my lips have touched it? Open wide! And don't drop a single morsel. I won't forgive you if you make a mess. I, I do not. I'm not enjoying this. Morsel from the leftover is shoved in my mouth. It feels gritty. It's an unusual texture. Like it's covered in thousands of small hairs. It tastes strangely. I can't even guess the food it used to be. I try to gulp it down before I can taste it. It's too big to swallow whole. I mean, just a bite and a half. I'm swallowing pieces. I might get it down before I gag. As I bite down, it bursts like a tomato, filling my mouth with a sweet juice. It tastes extremely fruity. Sort of pineapple-y, even. That is. That is good. It's better than good. It's great. It's a godlike nectar, instantly addictive ambrosia. More. I need more. It's too delicious to have. Just, what am I talking about? This, this purple. I mean, it is purple. It's seriously like nothing else. As soon as I swallow, I feel the immediate effects of withdrawal. My fond memories of other other food take the utter disgust. The mere thought of ever eating anything else makes my stomach churn. I greedily take another bite, filling my mouth with as much as I can. The smooth nectar bursting from every bite swims around in my mouth, coating every surface. It's so delicious that it's making my mouth tingle. Huh? Did I just bite my cheek? Why do I taste blood? The dull tingling suddenly turns into a sharp sting. Into an unbearable burning. My whole mouth feels raw like I'm gargling acid. It's like my mouth is being digested. I let to spit out, but my power fails me. I just can't bear to spit it out. It tastes too good. Just a little while longer. Let me chew it just a little while longer. Is that my tongue? Hey, look, my tongue. The food falls out of my mouth with a splat. It's a heap of bloody viscera. It might be imagination, but I swear I spit out twice as much as I put in my mouth. The horror. <sighs> Wipe away that sour expression, dearest. The next act is about to begin. And everyone will be watching. Oh, shoot. We're about to do this. No light besides open window. I love how she's just there. Lanetta, wake up! She's a crazy, crazy lady in my room. I don't want to mess this up. No, I'm already good. Skip! Skip! Keep going, keep going, keep going! I know how to read! I don't know how to read! Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Go, for I'm the king in yellow whose long shadows are. Yo, I'm about to get stabbed, I think. Oh, yeah, I got stabbed. Okay. Go, 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 go. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Da -da -da. Could you fix the hole in my chest? I have a hole in my chest hole. Thank you. Oh, thank you. You're all too kind. Where'd she go? She's gone. Listen to that applause, dearest. The euphoria of a flawless recitation. We're doing good. A memorable voice to make up the cacophony of cheering outside my door. Fanatical, reverly, screams of terror and sadistic amusement, all thunderous applause. The king has come. I'm proud of myself. Why, why didn't you use a stage knife? I'm really bleeding. Okay, we've seen this, we've seen this, we've seen this, we've seen this. Now what? Gonna ruin everything. Alright, let's do this.
I think I'm just absolutely destroying everything. Ow. Wait, stop. That <laughs> takes the book from we my hands. We need to talk. Are you breaking up with me? I... I wanted to apologize for being so nasty to you earlier. What's happening? Truth is... You're acting strange today. I was still coming to you so... Killing to you so much ago. I was so mad at I you. I just wanted to have the best prom work for a happy future together. So I thought I could scare you straight. But now I know that's not possible. Not here. Not now. You're just not the same person that ended reality for me so long ago. I mean, it's been a thousand so, years. So, let's break up. No. no! No, I'm sorry. Don't be. There's no need to end this reality just so we can have an unhealthy, failing relationship. <laughs> so, I'll go back to sleep. Before billions die, for my sake. Kind of my fault. <laughs> but where do we go from here? What's left after today? Tomorrow, silly. Oh, that's cute. You're taking the book with you, too? I'm just giving it back to Moo. It's not like I'll have a need for it. Hopefully this book never finds its way back to your world. For your sake, and mine. I'll handle the book, but if you survive, could you throw out the rest of these summoning artifacts? It's no good to keep things that remind you of me, you know? I'm sorry. It's a beautiful day outside. You should open the window. Maybe let in some light. <laughs> what? Maybe there's still a chance for us. In reality, far from this one. But the best I can do in this one is spare you. You're not going to kill me? No, I am going to kill you. To spare you from the slow, agonizing end. Oh, okay. I'm sparing you the pain of being alive when the fog lifts and reality sets in. You won't have to live to see the consequences of the spells you've already completed. Oh. At least this way, you won't feel a thing. Why, Goodbye, brother. Hey, let's fight. I want to kiss you anyways! Again. That's funny. Did we kiss? I don't even know. Wait, did we kiss? Oh, I didn't, I'm dead! Is that another ending? I got another one! Ah, I did! Alright, awesome. Hmm. I think we can try and get one more. Why not? We're having fun. Wait, what? Huh. Huh. Hmm. 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 Well, actually, wait. For love. First date. I'm not loading. No, get out. Sucker for love. First date. We have the secret book. No, 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 I did it wrong. No, I did the wrong thing. Close. Oh, no, I closed the game. Okay, well, oh, well. I guess I'll see everyone next time. Tomorrow's episode. <laughs>